Hi guys! Is there lipstick on my teeth? Always have to be aware. Hi everyone! So today I'm going to be doing my first date hair, makeup, and outfit video for you guys. Showing you makeup that I would wear for a first date, hair that I would wear for a first date, and also an outfit that I would wear for a first date. And I know that there's a lot of like pressure for first dates and a lot of nerves goes into going to your first date, but don't you worry. Basically, I just want to show you guys a basic, easy makeup tutorial. Um, most importantly though, you need to feel comfortable with what you're wearing and how you look on your first date. Do whatever you have to do to feel the most confident and I wish you all luck on your first date. I hope it goes well. So let's get into the makeup and let's go. All right guys, so for the makeup, I'm going to start with my eyes. You can kind of do what you want for foundation if you want to wear foundation. Um, I will link my foundation tutorial that I did a while back down below if you guys want to see how I do my foundation. Right now, I'm just wearing concealer. I'm going to work mainly, mainly. Hi, I can't talk. I'm going to work mostly on my eyes. So as per usual, I'm going to start by priming with this NARS eye primer. It's wonderful. So I'm just going to take this and apply it to my lids. Prime it up. Prime, prime, prime. And of course, for your date night, you're going to want to have your makeup look like good like come on I'm going to start with my Clinique Choco Latte palette which I used in my Valentine's Day makeup tutorial I did with my sister I'm gonna start with this nice shimmery color kind of a champagne color and I'm gonna use this in my inner corner and also work it out just to cover my lid and I have like crazy eyebrows right now I don't know if you guys can tell but like I haven't plucked them because midterms y'all just putting it out there that it's tough being me now I'm going to take the Urban Decay Naked palette of course what else would I use and I'm taking a uh, buck which is this shade right here and you guys know I love this color it's one of my favorites I'm just going to put that on the outer part of my eye and blend it up you don't want to go crazy on the makeup on your first date or else you will look crazy naked right here and I'm just going to kind of let that be my blending color and work that into the crease okay so now that I have my mascara on we are ready to move on to my blush which I'm gonna be using NARS orgasm because it's just a nice peachy kind of natural looking color and it's right there in this palette this is actually in my January favorites so I'm just going to dust this onto my cheeks. And I think blush is one of the nicest things that you can add to a look. It just looks natural. It doesn't look like, oh my gosh, she's wearing blush. It looks just nice and natural, but also gives you a kind of a fresh glow. So now that we have our blush on, it's time to move on to the last step, and that is lips. I'm going to start by using the Rimmel Lipstick in Nude Delight, and I like how moisturizing this is, so if you do have dry lips, it will not kind of cling to any dry patches that you might have. Mm. My god, I like actually can't open anything today. So I'm just going to apply this to my lips. You could totally leave it here if you wanted to, but I really like kind of having more of a pinky look to my lips. So I'm going to top it off with this L'Oreal, I don't even know what this is called, but it's kind of like a lip gloss. turns into a stain, which is nice, and it's in the color Rose on and on. So I'm just going to apply this. kind of has a weird scent. So for hair, I really like to keep things simple. I'm just going to add glasses to my face so I can actually see what I'm doing. Okay beautiful thing. So I'm going to show you guys kind of a simple hair um, that I do all the time, which is just what I'm wearing right now. It's really easy. So what I like to do is just part my hair down the middle. Mine's a little off to the side, uh, off to one side just because I have hair problems. I just take one section of hair that's by my face and all I do is I just twist it, twist it away from my face like that. Take a bobby pin and pin it. And that's literally all I do. That is the finished makeup look. Let's move on to the outfit. 